everybody it's sj and i'm just here doing like a little scrapbook update and showing you guys how i do some of my new scrapbook pages and maybe talking about some future plans i have for pages this is kind of just like a quick little fun video i'm filming um so this obviously is the same scrapbook i had when i made my first video um it's just gotten a bit thicker you can see how thick it's gotten um so let's open it up so the first major change that you can see right off the bat is I added in uh, four by six photos of the people on the pages. Um, everyone's but Jungkook's is unofficial. These are just pictures I printed off at Walmart, but the cards in the middle are official. So it's the same cards I had last time, um, but I now added in some four by sixes, like this cute one of him and his nephew, just some like, you know, my favorite photos of him. And then I did the same for Jihyo. Um, I just thought those were all cute photos of her. And then these are from the exhibition. I mentioned it last time when I had his all set up. Um, they're from the old new old exhibition. And these are the live photos. Uh, and then I added some photos of my little Sulgi. And these are all the same as I had last time. Um, you can kind of see here. That, you know, it's the same setup. I had, like, the one-by-ones, and then I had the two-by-twos. Uh, I don't remember what page I was working on last time. But. So, this is the backside of that page. And then the backside of the next one. Uh. And then I have this back side page. Um, and I know that this Jimin card isn't like one of my biases, but I traded it um, him for my. Uh, I had pulled Yoongi for Fifth Muster, and my friend collects Yoongi, so I traded for Jimin for. Her. So I just have him. <laughs> um, don't really want to sell him, or and nobody really wants to trade anymore. So. Um, same with this unit card. I pulled it out of the album it came in, which I think is Twice Coaster Lane 2. Um, I pulled it. Didn't want to trade it or anything. Units are kind of hard to trade for. I mean, I barely could trade for that album anyways. I ended up buying her cards for it, so. Um, and now I've started these, like, full pages. Um, just kind of something different. I've, like, ran out of, like, just regularly structured pages, like, um... As you can see, the pages back here, they have sideways, so it has to be like a unit or a sideways card. Um, same with this one. And then this one, once again, it's the same thing. They have to be like sideways, and a lot of PCs don't come that way. So, uh, um, that's why I haven't been using those. So, I'm going to probably buy more of like the ones that are like more photo card orientated. But for right now, I'm going to use up the rest of my full pages. So I've been doing full page spreads. This one is a tribute to my old bias group, Super Junior. Um, I have the Cry stickers. The Cry unit card I pulled. Or one of them. I think I buy, bought both albums. Did I? Yeah. Um, that's the Q-Hun card I got from it. I pulled Yesung and the other one. There's just a sticker I have that I printed myself, and then this is from the Super Show 4 DVD I own. Um, here is just a page dedicated to Jungkook. Uh, this is from Season's Greetings. One of my friends just sold it to me. She, like, split up her set and sold it. And then these are just some freebies I've gotten. Um, I just made this kind of fun page dedicated to the Love Yourself era. Just kind of different photos from there. Once again, all freebie photos. This was a part of a tapestry, and I cut it up um and put it on here and i thought it matched so there is a, another bts uh, dedicated to the notes and like the world building of bts universe so just kind of everybody on there um this is a jihyo page just some a page of some of the jihyo cards i've gotten so um this one was kind of fun i know it's a little busy but like I added stickers on the corners of these, and, like, this one has all little stickers that are puffy. Um, but, yeah. 
I just kind of made it kind of girly and kind of fun. And then I have um, specifically stuff for more and more. So like I have her coaster and I have her hollow pre-order card that I opened in my last unboxing. But that's yeah, just kind of some fun. And then I have some tour Jungkook merch. Um, I just bought these from some friends. These are mini PCs from, I don't know, whatever concerts or whatever things I bought them from. And I just bought them. Um, and then this is a fifth muster postcard of him and Jimin that I bought. And then these I got from freebies from somebody. So that's why they're there. And then I have some pages dedicated to my Beyond Lives I went to. So like there's the Super Show one. Um, here's all of Q Hun's merch that I got from there and some of my Q Hun, my favorite Q Hun shots. So, and then I started doing the same with Ji Hyo. And then I have some, uh, other ones in the box that I need to put in here. Same with The Cry. And then today I did this Jungkook page. Just another page dedicated to Jungkook. And then I did a page dedicated to sort of my alt groups of the past. I used to be, like... I used to ult New East and Black and Infinite and Shiny. Shiny's still an ult, but the rest have just kind of become just groups I listen to and enjoy. I don't really ult or collect them as I do with some of my other ones. So, so now I'm going to kind of um, show off how I'm like keeping everything. So you saw that I have the box, um, whose pages, some of the pictures that I've printed out of like the Beyond Lives. And then over there, it's my pile of paper. I have paper from when I was an American Girl fan. They had American Girl scrapbook pages that you could buy, and I have a lot of those. And then just other scrapbook paper I've gotten from Walmart or Michaels. And then a pile of stickers I don't use for freebies that I use for the scrapbook just itself. I've gotten most of these that either, like, super on sale. Like, I want to say that this one was, like, half off um, at Michaels. Like, same with this. These were cheap at Michaels. And then the other ones I've gotten from, actually, I don't think, I don't know. And then other ones I've just gotten from, like, the dollar store and like it's like this is from five below so um and then this is how i've been keeping my photo cards my mom and i i used to stack them on top of my lockers um where i keep my collection and it just was not working out so my mom and i were chatting and we put everything in a little box um but like you i've started even like sectioning off like the group freebies like Here's a ton of, like, BTS freebies. Like, this is all BTS freebies. But then I have, like, Sulky cards. And then I have, like, a pound of GKO cards. Because, obviously, there's a lot to collect. Um, and then I have some of my NCTs. Oh, I bought these off Amazon. They're, like, little little pockets. It's what uh, John Cook's, like, ID photos in. Just for the odd-shaped things. And then, so, like, here's some of my Super Junior stuff. So, just kind of different groups all sectioned in there I just thought that was easier to keep everything in um because like this is like my binder quote unquote I know some people just like stack them in their desk drawers but I thought the box was pretty neat um so yeah now we're going to make a page together so I do, I'm just going to use one of the full pages again and then I already tore it out and cut off the like white strip at top but I'm using some of my American Girl paper. And so it's just kind of like butterflies and hearts. Once again, kind of a busy little pattern, but just something fun. Um, and so the page that I'm going to do, I'm going to do a Yeri page, Yeti. Um, so I have these two PCs and then I have these two free bees that I got when I traded with somebody. So I'm going to create a layout. Um, I was kind of playing around with it earlier, and I was thinking of, like, making it like this, maybe. Um, just so that way it kind of, like, takes up the full page. So I think that that's the final kind of placements I'm going to go with. That looks good to me. So I do have tape to tape down the top loaders because these are all in pro sleeve top holders. Um, I do have like scotch tape for that. 
But for the freebies that I don't mind just like gluing down, I have glue dots. This is from the Recollections collection. I bought it at Michael's. It was on sale. Uh, big sale fan. So let's get to attaching these boys. Well, this lovely lady. Get position. So you just kind of make a little tape bubble and then I press it on the back and I flip it over and I kind of try and make sure the card and like the top holder straight. A lot of times I end up peeling it up and just repositioning the top holder until I'm kind of happy. That looks good. Alright. I'm actually going to position the whole thing down. Okay. Also, yes, that is a limited Yeri Summer Magic. Um, I pulled Joy for the album, I think. Yeah, for the album. Because I bought the limited, like, one with, like, the... Or is it... No. It was Rookie, right? I don't remember. I bought one of the limited albums. I had Joy, pulled Joy, traded it for Yeri. Not a surprise. I love... Yeti. Um, I tend to pull Joy a lot, but yeah, so, okay, kind of like the way it looks. So now I'm going to glue down the freebies, which this is sometimes the worst, because sometimes the glue dots just don't want to cooperate. I just kind of do enough just so it sticks. I don't like have a particular way or anything. Okay. So now that that's. So now that that's all on here, I think I'm going to pick out some stickers to build on the page to just kind of like fill it up. Um, first thing that I see, I think I want to do an ice cream cone from here, um, because obviously the, some photos from ice cream cake, that would be cute. Um, I actually haven't opened this package. These are from Dollar Tree. It was just like a thing full, so I think I'm going to use one of the puppy ones. I'm not seeing really anything pop out of this one that I really want to use. And then, obviously, I'm going to use these stickers, I think, to spell her name. I'm not really seeing any animals I want to use. So, set that aside. All right, let's first do the little Yeti's name. on there. I'm going to place the ice cream cone. I'm actually going to put the other ones back in here real quick. I'm just shoving them back into the package. That's the crinkling noise. Um, which ice cream cone should I do? Kind of like, I like the like the pink one on top more. Where should I put it? Hmm. Maybe, maybe up here? Huh? Yeah, yeah, that works. Um, I don't think I'm gonna do the cakes. There's kind of a little much. All right, let's see if there's any Hello Kitties jumping out at me. I think it's all the same repeating page. Yeah. I like the ice cream. 
I really like the pink ice cream, so I think I'm gonna do the pink ice cream. I think I am going to put it up and over here. Okay. Um, it's again the same ice cream designs. Um, I'm gonna keep this one out. I may use the cats with the sunglasses. use a butterfly those are i have a whole bunch of these little sanrio stickers probably should have like went through them before i filmed but um i'm not seeing anything on this one really pop out at me you can see where i got the bunny earlier for jump cuts and then here are some cats once again, I haven't really seen anything jump out at me for her. I like the idea of using some of the butterflies. So I am going to use some of the butterflies. Ooh, I've never opened this one. All right. Um, I like the idea of using her colors. Um, I think I'm going to put one here. I actually am going to move the ice cream cone maybe to here. That's cute. Okay, I'm gonna keep the butterflies open and off to the side. And then I have like a pound of stickers in here. Um, oh, I like the purple octopus. Oh, I think that'd be perfect. I'm gonna put him down here. I like the kind of purple kitty. Oop, I just tore him a bit, but oh well. How's this looking? All right, I think I'm just gonna put one more down here and then I think I'm gonna be good. Um, these are some llamas, these are dragons, some dogs, some cats. Um, sea creatures, some sharks, some narwhals. I kind of like the purple narwhal. And that should do it. Yep, so this is the final page. And so, and then I just transfer it into the little white thing. It just opens at the top and you just slide it in there and it becomes one of my pages and they look so fun. They're just something more creative than like just putting them in a binder and like flipping through it. I think this is more fun and really, oops. I just think this is more fun and really can reflect like the personality that it's stuff you like to share with your bias. Um, and it's just kind of something, you know, different from a traditional binder setup if you just kind of want to be creative and have fun. Um, I'm not, like, putting down binders in any way. There's a reason people do the binders. They're popular, easy to display, easy to flip through and look at. Um, but I just thought the scrapbook was just something that I would personally enjoy. So that's why I've done it. Um... And then, like, so, for instance, like, I have the bunnies and, like, I have a Jungkook sticker over here. I don't know. It's just, it's just some cute stuff. Something different, you know? And, like, I don't know. I really like the cute home layout and stuff like that. I don't know. It's just something fun to think about. And if you're kind of a creative person, something, something to think and something to do. So, I hope you all enjoyed it. Um, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe, comment, like, and I'll do all those fun YouTube things. And I'll see you guys next time. Remember to always love yourselves. See ya.